Yo, what's up y'all, it's your boy Hocus. We're back at again with another video. And in this week's video, I'm gonna be showing y'all my, my favorite analog and contact bangs. It's a little bit different for today's video, but I thought I might switch it up a little bit, see what see what y'all like, see what y'all want me to do. And yeah, we're gonna be posting every Monday. Got drum kits dropping, fire drum kit dropping soon. So yeah, without further ado, let's get right into it. So here we have Analog Lab. Analog Lab 5 and my favorite banks at Analog Lab 5. Shout out to all these people. Um, I bought all these kits, so just y'all could buy them. This one is the one I've been using the most. It's Artillery by Iza, Iza 2X, that's his uh, Instagram name. Y'all gotta hear uh, how crazy this sounds. So here's just the regular. I use this sub a lot. It's like a nice clean sub, listen. just some chill i don't know it's just it's just really good sub bass it has everything i'm just up here giving a little bit it has a lot of sub basses it has horn like it has everything we got a lot of stuff we got we got keys we got everything we got a lot of nice sounding stuff in here so this is my favorite one this is really good for ambient sounds like listen to this one like you know what i'm saying like really ambient pretty dark this pad right here. It's like a lot of pads, a lot of synths, and a lot of uh, keys. That's what this one's really good for. So this is the Artillery Bank by Iza 2X. Go get it. Next one we have, I don't use this one that much, but it's Devil in a Synth. Devil in a Synth right here by Hayes. But this one I use a little bit. I haven't used it too much. I'm gonna start using it recently. So this one's really good for also, just Analog Lab in general is good for pads and stuff like that. Contact is good for ethnic sounds like guitars, bells, horn, shit like that. This is just really good for, here's what this one sounds like. I don't use this one too, ma too much, but it's like a bell combined with a pad. It's pretty nice. And then it's just a lot of pads in this one, pads and synths. I use this one a little bit, as I said. Yeah, look how many banks there are. I think this one, you get your money's worth. There's 94 presets in the Iza one. I think there's only around 20 or 30. So this one, you get your money's worth. So yeah, it just has a lot of leads, stuff like that. Good for... I'd say this one's good for like darker, faster sell side ones. The easy one that I showed you, I'd say is really good for slower Pyrex stuff. This one we got Drowned in a Void. This one is also by Hayes as well. So this one, this one, and this one are by Hayes. I forgot to show you this one, but it only has three sounds, so I'm not even going to preview it. But Drowned in the Void is also by Hayes, and it has 45 presets. This one, I've used a couple of times and made pretty hard loose with it. But here, let me show you what it sounds. So here are some lo-fi keys. It sounds a little bit weird, but listen, like. This bank is really eerie, in my opinion. Like it's for, I think it's for like scary. If you know who Tizzle is, why Tizzle? He makes really hard loops. This is some shit that he would use. Like it's scary, eerie. I just give, give, it give you the creeps kind of like some for a horror movie and then the next bank is a uh, max shooter and Iza. but this one i use the most this one and the Iza one i use the most because it has a lot of nice sounds so let me just find an example real quick so we have this flute like flutes are not really good in analog bank in analog but this one's all right it's meant for like a really fake sounding flute it's not just supposed to sound like ethnic and stuff like that and then here we have some lo-fi keys. This is a combination of a bunch of different sounds. So all these ones that I have, I'd say you should go get them. These are all the sounds of an analog lab that I use. I mostly use analog lab. I don't use too much contact anymore. I'm going to get serum. I'm going to get expand. But right now I only use analog lab and contact, but I'm going to expand. These are my contact banks. We have Session Horns, Orchestra Complete, Strings of Winter, Storm Choir Ultimate, Vital Series Mallets, Hybrid Keys, Noir Piano, and the Spitfire Solo Violin. Sadly, I might not be able to load some of these up. So first off, we have the Session Horns. Oh, 
I'll just lay a little something down. Something like that. Like it's it's mostly for wheezy wheezy beats as you can tell. Just like whatever you use horns for, like Gunna, Wheezy, Keyed, Got It, mostly YSL. This one's the orchestra complete. Uh this is really good because you can either just load up the NKI or you can load up the individual instruments. So we have strings, all these strings look violins, and there's multiple violins. You can go you can go back more violins, then we have violas. We have cellos, we have cellos, a lot, like, a lot of them too, cellos, basses, uh, it's ensembles, um, more ensembles, and then we all, there's also, I'm not gonna go through every single one, but then there's brasses, French horns, trumpets, tenor horns, trombones, low brass, evil brass, then a woodwinds, flute, clarinet, oboe, bassoon, contra bassoon. I don't even know what these are. Percussion. There's these percussions. And percussions, bro. I just realized the percuss percussions are so good for loose. Because you can use them as background effects. Put a lot of reverb on them and stuff like that. Um, I'm not going to go through every single one like this. Like how I did for the first one. But then you have keys and harps. These are pianos and harps. You have string effects and brass effects. So... Orchestra complete is really good. You get your money's worth. There's a lot of different sounds, a lot of different options to choose from. Like it has everything. It's not just one specific sound. That's why I really mess with it a lot. Next thing we have is Strings of Winter. This is close to one of my favorite string banks. So we have just regular strings, then violins, vi violin twos, violas, cellos, and basses. Same thing as a uh, orchestra complete, but the strings of winter is just, I feel like it's better quality. Like it's made for strings. This one's focuses of a variety. This focuses on just strings. And then you have all these other strings, string effects. And uh, next thing we have over here, Storm Choir Ultimate. Storm Choir Ultimate is one of my favorite uh, choirs. I can't play it for y'all, as I said before. But you have men, you have pause, you have men's, you have the all every like uh, uh men, kids, and women all together. And then you have the Storm Choir Ultimate Woman. This is the one that I use the most. It sounds better. Then you have legatos. Legatos are I don't even know. I'm not even gonna play, but they're like quicker. I'm pretty sure no that's staccato. These ones are longer. Yeah, these ones are longer and they're more like fluent. And then I have no idea what these are. I think these are bases. I'm not even sure. Then we have the effects. The effects are what you put on top of the uh, the strings to give it some effect. And this one's really good. The Vital Series Mallet. Hey, I can load this one up for y'all. So what it is pretty much is it's like a full... I took a full look. It has marimba, xylophone, glockenspiel, tubular bells, glass marimba, song bells, vibraphone, crow tails, and you can add them all together. So this is what it's gonna sound like with all of them on. And this is not gonna sound good, but you can like make your own sound. So that's what it sounds like as everything. But let's say I just wanted the crow tails, marimba, and glockenspiel. Then I could do. That's why it's really good. I feel like this is really good for um uh got it beats keys beats that kind of stuff next one we have noir piano this one is just a dark piano it's really uh already has a lot of effects on it kind of but it's a regular piano it's just a bit more low five a piano and then these are my favorite strings the spitfire solo violin they sound so realistic you don't even understand they're so realistic very good quality high quality just all around a really good vst and that pretty much wraps up the video. I appreciate you guys for watching. Happy you made it to the end. Like, subscribe, comment. Appreciate it. Instagram's in the description. And I'm dropping a drum kit soon as well. Gonna have everything. 808, tie hats, midis, snares, everything. It's gonna have some loops in there. You see it over here. Official drum kit. Hi hat, uh, midis, 808 midis, and even snare midis for you guys. Maybe even open hat midis. I'm not sure. And yeah, I appreciate you guys for watching. Peace.